Welcome to Stock Invest YouTube channel and this stock report for ExxonMobil. The report was first published on our website Friday, April 29, 2022, but this is a more detailed version. Our aim is to help you answer the question, should I buy or sell ExxonMobil? In this video you will get insight in both the technical and the fundamental situation in addition to future price predictions. Please remember to subscribe, hit like and notification bell so you will be first to know when we post a new updated video. Our systems currently rank the ExxonMobil stock with a 2.352 score, and our system has ranked ExxonMobil by candidate since April 27, 2022. In this period the stock has had a gain of 0.72%. This is an average return of 0.24% per day since first recommended. In our daily updates for ExxonMobil our last headline reads, Red Day on Friday for ExxonMobil Corporation. The ExxonMobil Corporation stock price fell by minus 2.24% on the last day, Friday, April 29, 2022, from $87.20 to $85.25. During the day the stock fluctuated 4.06% from a day low at $84.70 to a day high of $88.14. The price has been going up and down for this period, and there has been a minus 2.89% loss for the last two weeks. Volume has increased on the last day by 1 million shares but on falling prices. This may be an early warning and the risk will be increased slightly over the next couple of days. In total, 35 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $2.96 billion. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $91.51, and the lowest price was $52.10. Right now the price is 6.84%, or $6.26, below 52-week high and 10.78%, or $10.30, below all-time high July 15, 2016 where the price hit $95.55. The stock lies in the middle of a wide and weak rising trend in the short term and a further rise within the trend is signaled. The current three-month trend indicates a possible 9.81% change over the next three months, with a possible return between 5.6% and 20.61%. The 12-month trend it indicates a 46.3% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between 20.08% and 54.88%. This equals a price between $102.36 and $132.03 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets From analysts ExxonMobil stock received a general buy rating. The analysts give P.E. ratio a strong buy and price to book a strong buy rating. For the return on investment the analysts give the ExxonMobil stock a neutral rating. In this section we will give you some information about signals found for ExxonMobil. We will start with the general picture before we move on some of the most famous indicators and signals that will give you a deeper and better understanding of the trading possibilities in the stock. There are mixed signals in the stock today. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Monday, April 18, 2022, and so far it has fallen minus 3.73%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is currently a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Volume rose on falling prices yesterday. This may be an early warning and the stock should be followed more closely. The ExxonMobil Corporation stock holds by signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a positive forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general buy signal from the relation between the two signals where the short-term average is above the long-term average. On corrections down, there will be some support from the lines at $84.83 and $83.79. A breakdown below any of these levels will issue sell signals. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence holds a sell signal. Pivots gave a sell signal 10 days ago. Bollinger gave a buy signal 10 days ago. The short-term moving average for the three-month chart gave a buy signal three days ago. The long-term moving average for the three-month chart gave a buy signal four days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages in the three-month chart gave a buy signal 27 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see short moving average gave a buy signal three days ago. The long-term moving average gave a sell signal 92 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages gave a buy signal 144 days ago. 
Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for ExxonMobil ExxonMobil Corporation finds support from accumulated volume at $82.79 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock is usually traded at a good volume, and with minor daily changes, the risk is considered to be low. During the last day, the stock moved $3.44, 4.06%, between high and low. For the last week, the stock has had a daily average volatility of 4.02%. The stock has a beta of 1.15. This tells us that ExxonMobil is 0.15 times more volatile than the market. Let us have a look at some fundamental data you should be aware of before we tell you some possible good trading levels for ExxonMobil. The price-to-earnings ratio, P-E ratio, is the ratio for valuing a company that measures its current share price relative to its per-share earnings. ExxonMobil currently has a price-earning ratio of 15.76. This is a relatively low price-to-earnings ratio and either signal a low expectation for the future of the company, or that the stock is undervalued and could indicate a buying opportunity. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, ExxonMobil meets first resistance at $85.36. If you do not hold ExxonMobil shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. On a downturn ExxonMobil finds first level of support at $82.79 and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounce upwards. In the table we have listed other potential swing trading levels based on the, the famous Fibonacci model. The average ratings combined from several analyst sources for ExxonMobil is buy. Here are some of the latest insider trades. On March 4, 2022 Chapman Neal A made an inside sell of 1,230 of common stock. On February 4, 2022 Littleton Stephen A made an inside sell of 10,000 of common stock. On February 2, 2022 Ubin Jeffrey W. made an inside sell of 1,500,000 of common stock, without par value. On January 3, 2022 Ubin Jeffrey W. made an inside buy of 2,500 of common stock, without par value, common stock. On January 3, 2022 Angelaki's Michael J. made an inside buy of 2,500 of common stock. Based on the 100 latest insides trades, we have calculated the insider power to be negative at a ratio of minus 16.734. In total, the insiders bought 14,244,656,301 and sold 1,688,456 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is $81.93, minus 3.90%. This stock has low daily movements and this gives low risk. There is a sell signal from a pivot top found 9 days ago. Is ExxonMobil stock a buy? Several short-term signals, along with a general good trend, are positive and we conclude that the current level may hold a buying opportunity as there is a fair chance for ExxonMobil Corporation stock to perform well in the short term. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For the trading on Monday 2nd we expect ExxonMobil to open up $0.78 cents and start trading at $86.03. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. That's the end of this video, thanks for watching. Remember that anyone leaving a company stand the chance of winning a lifetime subscription worth $495 to our services. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel to get all the latest videos and updates.